Hello IB History Scholars, it's Mr. Newcomb. We're coming to the conclusion of week five of Distant Learning. I want to start off though by giving you all a history high five. You worked extremely hard over the past few weeks here. Paper one exam means an end of the case study on Kosovo and unit three. So again, history high five. Grades will be updated over the next few days. So give me some time. Be sure to check into Schoology, see where you're at with your IB history grade. So what is the next steps? Normally, we would be prepping for the IB history exam, but IB has canceled those exams. So with week six of distant learning, we are going to use this as a catch up moment. Intermission, pause in IB history for week six. This will be an opportunity for you to work on any missing assignments, formative and summative, get them in. The enrichment assignments can still be submitted as well. After the intermission, we'll move back into the curriculum here, and that next assignment is going to be called Facing History. This assignment can be found in the Distant Learning Unit 4 History Studies folder. And so what you're going to be doing is analyzing a historical event or individual. Over the past several years, you have been exposed to or studied a variety of events and individuals, so here's going to be your opportunity to analyze one of them. And this assignment, though, is going to be due Friday, May 22nd, so plenty of time for success. Now, I'm not going to go further into the nitty-gritty details of this assignment facing history. can anticipate next week another screencast will come out with more um, detailed instructions related to that. So in the meantime, use this intermission as an opportunity to get yourself caught up. Recycle, re-energize here for that final push in uh, IB history. So with that, be safe and take care.